Hi everyone, my name's Kate and I'm the proud creator of a brand new clip-in hair extension product called Hair Hangers. For any of you that haven't seen Hair Hangers before, I just want to show you what a hair hanger looks like, what it does and how it can help you store, style and transport your clip-in extensions. Okay, I just want to start by showing you the problem I used to have before I had a hair hanger. It was tangled, matted, horrible extensions, wefts of hair that I'd find lying in a bedroom drawer, lying on the bedroom floor, um, I didn't know where they were, they got lost, and you can see that the condition of them really isn't what it should be, um, and that means that they just don't last you as long as they should. So I'm just going to show you the pink and white one to start with. So this is what a hair hanger looks like. You can see the hair hanging beautifully, and tangle free, silky smooth and you can see I've missed off one weft of hair here that's purely so that you can see in a moment when I'm styling um, how it works I'm just going to come closer so that you can see the pattern so you can see the hair hangers logo there pretty pattern and the butterflies and then if I spin it round so you can see from one end you can see that there's three hangers each one has a material band attached into it and you can see once I've turned it around there that each clip just clips on and off exactly as it would when it goes into your hair so there's no pressure applied to the grips at all so they don't misshape or get damaged and it's really quick to put them on and off and then you can see we've got two suction cups on the back now you can see there that these spin round slightly so one of my tips for you is make sure that these tabs are at the top when you come to styling them otherwise you might find them quite tricky to remove, you'll see in a moment what I mean uh, when you come to take your hair hanger down and then finally you can see that there's a hook which means you can store them discreetly away in a cupboard if you don't want them lying around your floor um, and you can also transport them around quite easily using that as a handle Okay, so when you're ready to style them, so if you've just washed them and you need to dry them, or if you want to curl them ready for a night out, or if you want to straighten them, whatever it might be, you just need to find a smooth surface to work with. So you can see that today I'm using the smooth surface of the wardrobe door. I'm also attaching it to the mirror so that you can see it attaches quite easily to the mirror as well. You can also use glass, so I use a window sometimes or the French doors downstairs. Just make sure you use a strong surface, that's all I say. The suction cups form a really strong seal, so make sure you're not using an old wobbly mirror or anything like that. You don't want to pull that off the wall. And then when you're ready, at any height that suits you, just apply a gentle bit of pressure, and there you have it. Your hair hanger hangs beautifully, and it means that you've got both hands free to dry and style and play with this lovely soft hair. Okay, I'm just going to do a really quick demonstration of how it works and how I do mine. Um, like I say, I'm not going to do a tutorial on how to curl hair or anything like that today. It's probably just to show you how it works. So when you're ready, just take the first two rows of hair away and attach them behind there. Now if your extensions are slightly shorter than these, these are 20 inches and they hang perfectly. But if they're slightly shorter, you may need to just grip them away just out of, out, of the, out of the way there, just in case they were to fall back down. And then you can see how easy it is when you've got the use of both hands. It's so much quicker. And you can see that by keeping your extensions in a tangle-free condition, um, it will just make their, their condition last a lot longer. So you can see how quick that is to do a row. Just do exactly the same thing and pull the first row out of the way and pop it around there. Now I just wanted to show you, the reason I left the gap is so that you can see there's a really good gap between each row. So it means when I'm working with the middle row of hair, there's no danger of entangling the, the back row of hair up. And obviously it's the same when you come to do the, the front row of hair with the middle. So you've got plenty of room to work with. Now when you use your hair hanger you'll find um, a pattern probably that suits you best. Um, so for example I put the wefts of hair on the front one, front band which I'm using first in my head and then the smaller grips, the, the one grips which I use at the top of my head I put at the back. But like I say you'll, you'll find a way that suits you better. And then finally pull the last row down and again you can see there there's plenty of room to work with 
without tangling the next row of hair up. You can see there's a little bit of give in the material as I'm working with the hair and that again means that as little amount of pressure is applied to the hair extension itself, um, just keeping them in a perfect condition. So I hope you can see how quick and easy that was to do and how much easier it makes your life. Um, when you want to take your hair hanger down, just make sure you're holding it firmly, lift the two suction cut tabs and there we have it. Beautiful hair that remains tangle free uh, for when you want to wear it or when you want to take it away with you. If you're taking it to the hairdresser for them to style or cut into your own hair, it's a perfect way to take it. Now it does rain a lot in England, unfortunately. Uh, and because of that, Hair Hangers comes with a cover. So if you are taking your hair on holiday with you or if you're taking it to the hairdresser, you've got a handy little shower proof cover to pop it inside, meaning that they don't get blown around or wet. And that's obviously the pink and white one going with the pink and white hanger. I'm just going to show you the other colour. So it comes in black and purple and you can see there there's a gold print. So just come closer so that you can see the pattern. See the Hair Hangers logo, it's exactly the same as the pink and white one. And I don't know what colour this comes across uh, on your screen, but you can possibly see it's a cabri kind of purple. So it's exactly the same as the pink and white. And then that also comes with a cover. So you've got the purple black cover there with the Hair Hangers logo in gold. And that hangs 20 inch extensions inside with them hanging perfectly straight. Obviously you can put any length of extension you want into there. It just means that the extensions will lie slightly at the bottom. Um, so I hope you can now see how easy it is to store your extensions, have them in one place when you want to wear them. How easy it is to style them, saving a massive amount of time. And when you want to take them about with you. Um, and if you want to keep them nice on holiday overnight then you've got the perfect way to transport them. So they're available now at hairhangers.com. Um, I hope you've enjoyed watching and hopefully I'll see you again soon.